what's going on guys welcome back to another news video so today we have some actual cool news samuel jackson talks about returning as mace windu and he's worked with bryce dallas howard who directed a few episodes of the mandalorian and he goes on to say that hey you know do you like me right so why don't you put me into you know the mandalorian you know mace can come back uh, he can just learn to use a lightsaber with a left hand because you know he's got that one hand obviously he gets a robotic arm at one point and this is essentially his confirmation that he wants to come back if you guys didn't know already which he's expressed many times so one of the things that he said to george back during the prequels was hey so can i still be alive because jedi can fall from really high distances and still be fine and george was like yeah you can be alive i'm fine with that so in canon mace windu is definitely alive he is around somewhere but we just don't know where we don't know what the heck is going on with them. The problem I have with Mace coming back at this point in time in The Mandalorian is that it just doesn't make much sense because it's it bypasses episode four, five, and six. And I feel like Mace Windu would be literally the first person to want to get revenge uh, against Anakin and against Sidious. So where the hell was he this whole time if he is alive? They would have to do a really good job explaining that. And I think the only plausible answer to that is perhaps... Sidious was, you know, controlling him. Maybe he was dead on impact, you know, when he fell off of Palpatine's office in Coruscant, or he hit some ships on the way down and, you know, got some head trauma and Palpatine had to control him somehow, you know, kind of like Lobot and sustain his life and bring him back to life. And perhaps he was just, he weakened his force ability or he weakened his mind so much that Palpatine was able to get in there. And, you know, this is maybe a segue or it could be a, a continuation sort of into how he controls Snoke. And maybe he's experimenting with different things. And I don't know, they could play with something like that. I wouldn't like it. I'm not a fan of it. Obviously, Mace Windu to me is a big deal. I mean, my whole fan film is based around vader fighting mace windu but it, it takes place in the time you know just months after revenge of the sith so it makes a little more sense to me because if mace is around for such a long time don't you think he would be searching for obi-wan or searching for yoda or you know looking uh to even help luke if he finds out who he is so uh let's go ahead and watch the clip and uh we can uh continue to talk about it like me right <laughs> it's just like, oh. Everybody back, Sam. What's going on? The Obi-Wan trailer just dropped the other day. Is Mace Windu, he's alive with one hand somewhere. 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 Yeah, somewhere. Well, that's the same way I think about dude from, you know, Jurassic Park. He's somewhere <laughs> riding around on velociraptors <laughs> with one arm. You know, he's, he's just on the island just... <laughs> right. <laughs> riding raptors, you know, but... Should I hold out hope at this point for that's Mace? A, that's you... a huge history of people with one hand returning in Star Wars. Uh, I, asked, I asked, the only person I've ever said that to about coming back was Bryce Dallas Howard, because I, I just did a movie with her, and she directs episodes of The Mandalorian and stuff. So, so you think you might be able to right, hook a brother up? <laughs> and, uh, and, I mean, you like me, right? <laughs> and she's like, I love you, you're amazing. Put me back in this. <laughs> Put me back Put in the me game. In, I'm ready. <laughs> Put me in, coach. I'm ready. You know, I learned to, you know, lightsaber left handed. Come on. Put me up. <laughs> I mean, I, yeah, dude, I would, of course, I would love to see Mace Windu. But I just, story wise, I would be like, where the hell was he? So they have to come up with a really good answer as to, you know, um, you know how Vader wants to kill Obi Wan? I just feel like Mace Windu wants to kill Anakin. You know, he wants to kill Sidious for everything that they did. He never liked Anakin, anyways. His issue with Anakin was that he was uh, trained too late in life and uh, he was so conflicted. He didn't trust him. And he was right to not trust Anakin. Anakin was definitely emotional. But I feel like with the proper guidance, Anakin could have been a really strong team member and he could have been trusted and a lot of the things that happened in Star Wars could have been avoided very easily. So anyways, I'd love to know what you guys think. Should Mace Windu return in Star Wars? Should he not return? Why or why not? Either way, you guys are going to see him in my fan film and um, I hope you'll enjoy the finished product. So have a great rest of your day and I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, remember, the Force will be with you always.